go, James. Fuck's sake. So, hey, Ron. What about putting that in front of the gas station guy's place? Will he let you? What about putting this in front of the gas station guy? Will he let you do that? Yep. The yep. truck. I'd rather put it somewhere on mine. Where? Well, I'd have to go look, but over on that side somehow. Well, tell me, and I'll do it. Because with that, I, I can get this done in a second. Without that, I don't really know. Where do you want it? I think you can just back it right in that hole. Boom, I see the hole now. Okay, James moves the car and then what? I mean, you move it and you come look for the next thing. You come get in the middle of the action. You talk to the people who are out there who are the bosses and who are in charge and who help you learn something. James seems to have sat in the car and went back to Betty Bye. Yeah, I don't know, buddy. We'll see. That's perfect. You're a fucking maniac. You're good. <laughs> I can drive that thing. <laughs> um. And then I guess just push those three straight back to the fence here. And we won't hurt them. I'm going to pull out or whatever you my excursion to where I got it out. And then you want like those two out of the way. Well, I guess he had to get his pants on. I bet you we just got him going too early for that. So, we'll see. We'll see. He's still threading that fucking, he's still threading that thing into there. But he's helped me back out. So he's kind of at work. Okay, we need to put the CTS and the Infinity over here. Okay. There you go again. Just watch out for that dish. Straighten it out. Back, back up. Back, 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 back. Turn the other way slightly. Back, 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 back. Okay, now go that way. Now turn this way. Now go on.
Whoops. Somebody much shorter than me has been driving this. Oh, that's a nice car. I like it. It's going to take 10 minutes, I bet. Try it out. But yeah, I don't know. It's dead as a doornail. So we'll let it charge for a few and then move it. Um. So, have you? are you ready to do things or are you not ready to do things yet? Well, no. Have you got to get ready or anything or what? Have you... Or did you just? Okay, then do your do your thug fizzle there. Do your stuff. Do your stuff. I just need to move this. Here's what I need to do. I need these blown up. Okay. To where we can push this back. Other than that, um, get ready, do your thing, and then um, talk to me. We'll push this back. We'll move this. They're tearing this out today. So I don't know what that's going to do to us, but in the end, at least we'll be able to use this area now. So I just gotta keep on him and make sure we're good. And that's my main thing for the morning. And I'm leaving noon or before. Okay, yeah, that's right. And so I don't know if you'll be helping my dad today, but I know you've been helping him a bit the rest of the week. And when it's not raining here, I'll leave you with three things you can do. And I think I sold the van the other day. Sweet. The scan van, so we won't have to detail it. Wrong pipe out. We're gonna let that charge. Get the batteries pumped up, and then we'll get it. Just tell us. We'll keep on it. We're getting out of here. That's what you need. That's okay, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's a, those two, yeah. Okay. <laughs> tie it around a hanger and shove it through. You tie one end around a hanger, and you stretch the hanger out, and you shove the hanger through the pants. What's in Montana? I have a ranch up there. Me too. You, that's too bad. I feel bad for you. No, I don't. I love it. I love it up there. If it was work, that's where I'd be. Yeah. Whereabouts are you at? Lincoln. Oh, cool. Lincoln's beautiful. Yeah, right between uh, Missoula and Helena, right? I own the other side of Drummond there. There's, Drummond, yeah. Uh, and my dad's got a ranch. He's over. Well, he's in the shitty part. He's in Wolf Point in Glasgow type area. I don't know. Oh, I know in Glasgow. But he's got like... 20,000 acres of shit land over. I like where we are in Lincoln and yeah. Drummond. That's a lot nicer. I'm right on the, the Blackfoot. I'm from Calisto. Oh, yeah, he's got some up there too. Oh, that's nice. This one, right? Okay. Well, we can back it. We can pull it back a bit. You might not need it. Shit, I could probably come in on this side. Give me like three minutes. I told him to go to McDonald's and pump up the tires. Guess which one he did first. <laughs> He's right at the light. And I've got air going in, so I'll get it in a second here. A lot of Montana here. A lot of Montana. <laughs> love it. I just love fishing. I'll get an elk. Oh, you got good fishing up there. Yeah. Yeah. You, you say you go for elk too? I get an elk every once in a while. If I've you want fishing. antelope or deer, let me know in the Why east. Like, He's got so much to hunt. He does. Why is Lincoln in my mind famous? What's weird about that? Lincoln, Montana? Anything history-wise? It's just, there's a lot of history there. Um, Ranchers. I mean, my neighbor is a Mennonite, and he owns 30,000 acres, which, you know, like your dad. But on that side of the state, it's a whole different story. Yeah. <laughs> he owns, and then... And oh, okay. Then, um, which one's yours, Kevin? Is there anything in you in here? Uh, no, that's all you. I just put um, the air compressor on. Okay. Basically, we're going to push this back. We just need the tires pumped up. And then we'll start on stuff. Hit me up after we're good on them. And... Um, Will. I got these changed for
This might not even have to start. We can just charge it. Okay. But so let me, uh, just do what you're doing in the air, and I got it charged. The air is almost full, and yeah. Hit me up when you're ready to do something after that. Lincoln's famous to me for when you're driving back from Great Falls or something. It's always beautiful because there's always deer in the town right at nighttime and morning time. I love it. Yeah. I'll just I'll, I'll sometimes pull over and walk up and down the street and just look at shit because it's just real right pretty town. Right off the 200 on that. You know, if you know where Nevada Lake is, um, past Nevada Lake, six, six, six miles past there on the right hand side, just below the scapegoat. No. See, we come across Helmville up the back way sometimes mm. and it dumps you out, I think, above it? Above it. Above it a little bit. He's with Hi, you? Danny Cakes. He's with you? Yeah. Okay. He's not from Montana, though. Oh, dude. Dan, not Danny Cage. I know. We, we can't be calling you. I mean, that might be, you might know each other. We don't know you that well, right? <laughs> that does look well built, Ron. <laughs> Looks like doggy turds. But they actually started ripping this thing out. And the minute they did, they found out this is a lot more serious of a foundation. That's fucking a foot and a half already. But it's a lot more serious of a foundation than what they were thinking.